Hey guys, welcome back to the channel, and welcome back to RimWorld! I'm still happy to be playing this. So, last time, I kind of walked you guys through some of the uh, growing mechanics, uh, some different survival things, and yeah, we expanded our crops. We have a lot going. And for anybody who is wondering, uh, if you're new to the series, I am in fact playing this with mods. Uh, quite a few of them actually. The uh, vanilla expanded mods on the Steam Workshop, so I highly recommend those. They add a ton of new things to the game, and yeah, I just enjoy playing with mods. But yeah, welcome back, guys. So right now we're just kind of getting people. Oops, not that. Getting people moved into their own rooms because uh, if you guys remember last time, I told you that um, they don't like sharing a space. I mean, they hate sleeping on the floor, but they really hate sharing a space. So we're going to speed up time here a little bit. Medical treatment. Oh yeah, some of our guys uh, are sick, which is fine. Because as long as people who are sick are just able to rest, they should be. Uh, where's my healer? I have a, I have a doc somewhere, don't I? All right, here we go. Treat them. And as long as our sick people get to rest, they'll be fine. Because then the, if the cold and the infection can't spread as quick. So as long as we stay ahead of it, everything will be okay. Come here. Treat them. It's going to be very bad if, like, on the third episode, whatever this is, we have two people die from a cold. That would suck, honestly. Like, that would be... There's a shitty way for two people to die. Oh, that's one of ours. I thought that was a random one eating that. Okay, right, if you guys want animals, like wild animals, not eating your crops, build a fence around them. It's the best way to keep them from eating your food. Is there an automatic refuel off for now? Let's go ahead and harvest up some of these, because this is all wood, that's all food. Our guy's just out there howling his brains out. Uh, we're still growing, or no, we're still planting, I mean, uh, heel root, we got tomatoes going in. Holy crap, buddy, what's your problem? What's your howling? Who's my cook? Who's supposed to be cooking? Oh, okay. Uh, so when we feel that. Oh, I'm a little stuffy today. It's a little chilly. Okay, so we got no meat for pemmican. Let's go ahead and make some meals. We have quite a bit of that. And do we want to harvest the rice? It's 90% done. Eh, we shouldn't need to, necessarily. Calling us need beds. Well, we don't exactly have the means to make beds right now, so... Sue me. How are we doing? Staying just ahead of the cold. Or the flu, I mean, so it should be okay. I think one thing we might have to invest in pretty early on is probably better medicine. Okay, we're just going to go ahead and harvest the rice now. So let's go ahead and just... Oh, no, no. Yeah, yeah. Don't sow it. Because what I want to do is I want to till the soil. Because I can do that, right? Yeah, we can till the soil. Tilling the soil will help it grow a little bit faster. And I believe produce a little bit more. I could be wrong on that. I haven't really paid attention to what it does specifically. Exhaustion. Need to put a table. Well, I can't really do much about that at the current moment. Or can I? Do have a table? Do we have tables? We do have tables, but not a lot of wood. Yeah, we're not gonna worry about that right now. 70% quality, nice, so... 40%? Uh, dude, come treat her. Her? Him? 
her. Shoot her. Wait, oh. Wait. Okay, I must have deleted uh, bear's sequence spot by mistake. Hey, bear, if you're so tired, stop cooking. Holy crap, dude. Great memory. What does that do? Has my time memory for detail. She'll lose unused skills at half the rate. Oh, yeah, because if they don't use certain skills, they go down. Cleaning this up. All right, so so far so good. <laughs> Nothing's gone overly, overly wrong yet. <laughs> Knock on wood. But yeah, I'm quite uh, quite happy with how this is going. What are we currently researching? Stone cutting. Okay, we do need that. So what I'm thinking. Once we have stone cutting, we turn this, make this original cave home, into a fortress. So that way, if we get overrun, we have somewhere to pull back to. Because raids and stuff in this game can get hella fucking hard. Like, holy crap hard. So if we have somewhere to pull back, it'll be fine. Because this is already pretty well defensible. Or defendable if we, like, carve this out and organize it a bit. And then like, we can slowly start expanding out. Fuck! What did I just say? I had to say it! How many? Oh, so there'll be only three of them. We're not going to draft these two because they need to be resting. Yeah, they need to stay resting. Come on, evil bunnies. Get the bunnies! You are currently bleeding. How many meals do I have bear making currently? Uh, that's the last one. Uh, that'll be one for okay. One for okay? <laughs> that will be okay. Uh, dude. Treat your buddy. He's currently got his ass kicked by rabbits. And how am I you can get treated again? Uh, we can get treated here in a little bit. I don't care what your problem is, just deal with it. Okay, maybe we need some more meals. Okay, let's do... 5, 10, 15, 20, 25. 25 meals. We think that's 5 per person. Which will be a sufficient amount. Perfect. Nope. Go over here and treat them. I don't care what you're doing, this is priority. Ah! Psycho Bunny! I was so confused. I was like, what the fuck's happening? <laughs> Bear's got her ass munched by a Psycho Bunny. Everybody's gotten their ass kit at some point right now. <laughs> oh my god, that's too funny. There we go. Oh, come on. We got an infection. It's wonderful. Let me select them. How bad is it? 
It's pretty bad. Oh, that infection stain pretty well had the medicine actually. Uh, I'm slowing down actually. Oh wait, we might be able to beat it. Ooh, it's gonna be close. Oh wait, nope, we'll be good. Ah, fuck a duck. Uh. Oh, good. Bear's fully healed, so we can, she can keep making food, which is great. We need people making food because. This is going to be a problem now. Oh, uh, lovely. I just want to my soundproofing back up, so this is going to be echoey as crap. But I can't read too much about that, so whatever. How are you two doing? Are you two almost able to get back to work? Uh, not quite. We're staying ahead of this infection. Uh, you know, as long as we're staying like a percent. Oh, we're two percent ahead of it. It's fucking perfect. That's perfect. All these other crops are doing good. Uh, wood is doing okay ish, I guess. And a decent amount of food being made. So overall, I think we're doing pretty well. So I'll catch up with you guys here in a few minutes. Okay, the wake them to a dry thunderstorm. Goodness is we're not in a forest or anything, so dry thunderstorm really won't be too bad. You know, unless it strikes like right here, then that would be a problem. But right now everybody is doing okay. 75% immunity on that one, so it'll be healed soon. 92%, so 
She'll be healed up very soon. 57, still got a while to go for him. Wow, we're at that strike. Overall, we're doing okay. It's mostly just a wildlife that's been kicking our ass. They haven't gotten their asses handed to us too badly yet. Keyword yet. So psychopathic Easter Bunny is still here, just bleeding to death. Oh, plush fluffy bastard, just stay there and think about what you've done. Oh, great. doing too much harm to herself. I know she's not happy, but still. Whatever, I'm just gonna let her do her thing. Just gonna ride it up. Making her sleeping spot here. Small fire up there, but it shouldn't be too bad. Are you okay now? Oh, sweet. The keeper's fucked up. Ah, what the fuck? Okay. We got a psychopathic emu. We're not fucking with that. Everybody inside. Psycho bird! No. Ah, ha, ha, ha. fuck you. Stay inside. Stay out there. Fucking psycho bird. Okay, so far, wildlife seems to be the biggest issue in this region. Almost good, almost good. You're doing okay. Oh, actually, yeah. We're staying like 8, like 9 to 10% ahead of the infection, so. Yeah, that's fine. He'll be fine. Everybody's gonna make a full recovery. What's that fire? Good news is the grass is go. Whoa! What did I just say? Like seriously, what what did I just say about the fire landing right there? Doing good about it at the moment. Oh, and my boom almost dead. Shocking. Oh, I was probably gonna get rid of it anyway, because they're kind of useless. Besides, you know, for doing that, obviously. Okay, go fight that fire. Save the crops, people. Come on. Let's get these fires put out. They're burning our crops. Oh, shit. How far away are you? If you're close enough, we should better rescue you. Um, we're right there, and you're right there. 13 days. Uh, we'll probably do that once everybody's, you know, healed. I feel like that would actually be a good idea. Boom, all self-tamed. <laughs> fucking funny. One just blew up, and we got another one. Actually, wait, where are you cooking? Aren't you our researcher? Wait, you're not dead, are you? Oh, fuck. Oh, you're just incapacitated because of the infection. <laughs> I was thinking, oh my god, someone did not just die. Thank god for that. 
No, he's good. He's got to recover now. Anyway, why are you cooking? Are you another one of my cooks? Are you a night owl? What are you? Come here. Let's see your stats. Uh, level 8 cooking. Level 4. Oh, okay, so you are our main cook. You're a researcher. Oh, he is. Okay, well, I guess Bear can come off of um, cooking and go back to whatever he was doing. And, uh, okay. You'll be fine ish, I think. You guys go fight the fire. Who's all get treated? I didn't see. Yeah, you need to get treated. Burp. Yeah, I know we're low on medicine, but I already got more plantain. Yeah, we got the plants being harvested, and everything seems to be going. Oh, we got enough meat for some time we can now. I think. Oh, wait, we need fruit too, I think. Yeah, I'm not sure. Alright, we do have enough time we can, okay. We're going to restrict access to the pemmican. As, oh, it's five each, right? I forgot. We'll restrict access to the pemmican because it lasts for so long. And then we'll just keep making normal meals. We're actually looking pretty good. He's a lazy bastard to get up and start doing his research. Actually alive. It would have sucked if in a, in like less than two weeks of being here we lost like three people. That would have been shit. But also totally apart for Rimworld. Rimworld is such a hard fucking game, but it's also one of the funnest. Can you? No, ostrich. What's a round that we can hunt? bunnies around. You're still a man. Okay, no, you need to die, because you cannot be allowed to heal. You need to die. You? Uh, kill that thing. Just, um, make more pemmican. We'll have to make some more meals here soon. <laughs> Alright, we got a lot more food. We're stripped to pemmican. Made the pemmican real quick, then go to sleep. <laughs> Oof, pick up slowly. Times four. Just get it done faster. How much meat is on the times four? It's five each. So five, ten, twenty. I would think twenty. Sixteen. Yeah, twenty. Okay. That adds up. And then we'll go back to making normal meals, because we're going to need them. 
So she's probably gonna stay up a, a little bit later. Because uh, we're gonna need meals for the morning, so. She's not gonna be happy about that, but it's fine. Five. Let her sleep for a bit because uh, she's not going to be happy about this. Actually, she's fine. She doesn't need that much sleep. Not what I wanted to do. Okay. No longer wandering in sadness. Perfect. Anyone tries to eat the raw food, we're gonna stop them because they can they can wait a few minutes for the food. There we go. But then we kinda wanna save as long as possible for if we have any issues. Now who has food on them right now actually? Okay, uh, okay they almost all do. Okay, so she can stop prioritizing the cooking now. She can do it if she wants, or she can go sleep. You get... Oh. They don't have any reckon, anything for creation. I thought they did. I swear I made them some. That's weird. That's very weird. Where I made them some. Okay, let's give them a break. Kinda about here. So they can get some recreation time in. Cause I could swear I made them some already. I must have got destroyed and I just didn't realize it. Alright, so let's go ahead and till the soil there. Till this soil. we go, now we're getting somewhere. Lots of food, good amount of meals stocked up. So I'm thinking, I'm thinking, I'm thinking, I'm thinking. Definitely need to get the uh, stone cutting research done. Who's researcher again? Oh, she is. Oh, she's also our cook. Let's switch these two out for a bit, because uh, bears aren't really doing anything. I mean, bears are grower and stuff like that, but uh, she's not very, she's not very doing it. What can, what can you do? Uh, for the time being, a whole lot of nothing. There's no water sources around, is there? No, so being a fisherman's kind of pointless. I guess let's go harvest some more wood. The next thing we're gonna need is uh, this tree planting after we get the stone cutter stuff up. What's that? Oh, peaches. Peaches, pears. Yeah, we're actually doing really well. I am surprised, even for me. And we are doing so well. I was gonna chair because because one thing I do remember is that seats increase the speed of work work spots. I don't like when when cougars and shit are around. It must make you feel nervous. I don't know why you can't just focus down here, dude. Nick, seriously. 
Well, I think this is going to do for this episode, guys. We've made some great progress lately. We have more rooms. Actually, let's go ahead and just get this room uh, squished over now. So don't forget. Come here. Come on. Sit in the spot. Thank you. Let's go ahead and throw a bear in there. My bear's got their own sleeping space. And there we go. Yeah, we're making some really good progress, I feel. We have enough to make anybody a bed roll. We have 32. We need 40. Not quite enough. Well, anyway, with that said, guys, thank you guys so much for watching. If you like this video, hit the like button. If you haven't yet, consider subscribing. It means a lot. Help the channel grow. Make sure you turn notifications. Get a howl every time I have a new video. That's it. I'll catch you on the next one. Peace, guys. Thank you.